you know, as, as we're rolling out robot teams throughout the state, I'm thinking, how can we build on this? Uh, I was in Ito's office one day and I saw the Coder Z platform and I said, that's what we need to do. And I said, this is a great opportunity to take the robotic stuff and leverage it into the coding world. You know, when you learn how to code, you really get good at logic. Like you understand how things function. And so this is another opportunity to help those students build those logical and critical thinking skills uh, to help them solve problems. And that's really what the challenges are all about. Unbelievable amount of ex excitement about this whole program. You know, as the educators have jumped in with their students, they've recognized that the platform and the competitions are set up in a way that they can really easily access them uh, and make them available to their students in a way that, you know, can fit those students at all different levels. Like you could have a kid who's very advanced in terms of their coding capability to a student who's just a beginner at their coding capability, and all of them can find opportunity to engage in this project. Uh, so they're excited because we've really done, what we've done is we've created another, you know, pedagogical tool for them to be able to use with their students. I mean, the competition just makes it fun, but it's not all about the competition. It's about really engaging in the challenges that we're putting at the kids, uh, you know, working with each other. They're kind of paired up in teams. Uh, they're challenging themselves against other schools, which they like that aspect of the competition. So I think everybody's just have a great collegial spirit and is enjoying the process. New Hampshire, like every other state around the country, uh, is trying to find educated workforce students who have the capabilities to engage in a 21st century economy. And this program in particular gives kids, kids those coding skills, those coding opportunities that allows them to move into those STEM fields. And so we're excited to excite the kids about you know, moving into those fields. It's interesting, too often when we talk about STEM career opportunities, uh, you know, we're talking at students with adult language and we say like, oh, to go into STEM, that'll be fun, you can get a good job. Honestly, 15-year-old kids aren't interested in getting a good job, they're interested in having a good time with their friends. And what we've done is we've created a synergy of both of those things, where the kids are engaged, they're having fun, but they're also acquiring skills that are going to help them in the future. And Intellitech has come in and is serving as a great partner in this coding project to enable students, again, to get those experiences around coding. May the code be with you!